down at Hastings. This was a moment they found out their fate in that FA Cup draw. If they can overcome Harrogate, they will go to Middlesbrough to take on uh, Tony Mowbray's Middlesbrough, who just on Friday night there went to Birmingham, put up a bit of a show, but didn't get the win they wanted against Birmingham. Birmingham won that. But Hastings have got a big one if they can overcome Harrogate. Let's go live now. Hastings United, the lowest ranked team left in the competition. As I say, a trip to the Riverside against Middlesbrough, up for grabs. If they can win their second round replay, and that is against Harrogate. We're joined now by uh, Hastings assistant manager, Mark Stabley. Mark, good afternoon to you. How do you feel about that draw then? Oh, we're more than happy down here with the draw. Just, just a dream come true. The dream carries on. The dream carries on. Before you can get an attempt, a shot at goal, if you like, against Middlesbrough, you've got to see off Harrogate. And we were speaking to your chairman a little while ago. You, you've got problems with the goalkeeper, problems with, with your striker. You've got to get, go in against Harrogate somewhat under strength. But the incentive there to beat them is now huge, isn't it? Oh, I mean, the boys are right up for it. Um, so yesterday our goalkeeper got injured after 10 minutes. Um, he soldiered on through the game and um, the boys are just buzzing now. They're really buzzing. It's, it's just an unbelievable tie. Terrific. I take it, Martin, there'll be very few people left in the Hastings if you can get to Middlesbrough. Well, I think we took over 300 yesterday to Harrogate, so I would assume now we'll take, uh, hopefully, uh, 500 plus to Middlesbrough for this big tie. We can see what it means to you now. When, when does the planning start? I mean, obviously now you've got your eyes on the replay, you've got to get through that. What kind of job in hand is, is involved there? Um, we've We've, we've got a couple of games before the replay. We've obviously got to um, focus on them as well. Um, but uh, next Tuesday night, with the replay, uh, you know, once we win that one, then we start the planning of where we're going to go and where we're going to go to Middlesbrough. Uh, of course, you're, we're, we've been saying you're, you're, you're the lowest ranked team left in the competition. By no means am I being disrespectful to your players, Mark. How would you describe the bunch of lads you've got at Hastings United? What sort of boys are they? Oh, the, the lads we've got in the side now uh, are all uh, very young, but they've, they've, they've just grown over this season. Um, you know, the, 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 just the whole team co uh, camaraderie is brilliant at the moment. Uh, and they, obviously the FA Cup has helped with that. Fantastic. Mark, we wish you well. We're delighted for you this afternoon. It's been great uh, speaking to you fellas. And good luck with the replay first and foremost. Yeah, thanks very much. Just like the fan call, the supporters that we've got, they, they are superb. They are the 12th man for us and, and uh, you know, they've, they've travelled all over for us How and we really appreciate it. Well said, Mark. Thanks very much indeed.